wondered how devices in an industrial setup communicate with each other? It all comes down to something called PLC communication protocols. These are like the languages of the industrial world, allowing devices to talk to each other to coordinate their operations. Imagine a symphony orchestra. Each instrument, from the smallest flute to the largest drum, knows exactly when to play and what notes to hit. This seamless coordination is achieved through a system of signals and cues from the conductor. In an industrial setup, PLC communication protocols play the role of the conductor, directing the operation of various devices. Let's dive into some common PLC communication protocols used in industrial automation. First up is Modbus. Acting as an open and widely used communication protocol, Modbus facilitates communication between PLCs and other devices. It's a bit like a master and servant relationship with the master device initiating requests and the slave devices providing the data. Next, we have Profibus. This protocol supports both decentralized and centralized automation architectures, offering high-speed communication. It's a favorite in industries such as manufacturing and process control. Then, there's Ethernet IP. This protocol uses Ethernet as the base for communication, allowing real-time control and synchronization of devices. It's like having a direct line from the factory floor to the enterprise-level systems. DeviceNet, developed by Rockwell Automation, relies on a controller area network for communication. It's a bit like a party line, supporting multiple devices on a single network. This protocol is primarily used for simple device-level control and monitoring. Profine, an open industrial Ethernet protocol, is used to communicate between PLCs and other automation devices. It offers high-speed communication and real-time control, integrating seamlessly into existing Ethernet-based networks. Finally, we have EtherCAT or Ethernet for control automation technology. This real-time Ethernet protocol is widely used in industrial automation. It provides high-speed communication with synchronized control, making it ideal for applications that require precise timing and synchronization. So, which protocol is the best? Well, it's not one size fits all. The choice of protocol depends on various factors such as specific application requirements, network infrastructure, compatibility with devices and systems, and the capabilities of the PLC used. In summary, PLC communication protocols are the unseen conductors of the industrial orchestra, directing the operation of devices in a harmonious symphony of efficiency and control. Whether it's Modbus, Profibus, Ethernet IP, DeviceNet, Profinet or EtherCAT, each protocol plays a vital role in ensuring smooth communication in an industrial setup. So next time you marvel at the efficiency of an automated process, Remember the unsung heroes, the PLC communication protocols.